In rural areas here, like Genesee and Orleans counties, it's difficult to come up with the staff to be able to run these testing programs. That's why this is an all hands on deck situation here in Genesee County today. We have our city council, Batavia City Council president here. We have our chair of the county legislature. We've had our own public defender and our commissioner of social services. We have probation officers. We have highway workers. Uh, we have people from emergency management and the health department helping us out. Even volunteers from the local Rotary and Kiwanis Club chapters jumped in to assist with the state supplied rapid testing clinic from 1 to 4 p.m. on Tuesdays and Thursdays at this fire training center in Batavia, Genesee County, and similar hours on Wednesdays at the Orleans. County Fairgrounds in Albion. With the numbers that were spiking in our region and in, in Western New York in general, that, that th this was needed. So uh, between us and Orleans County is doing a similar effort and then Wyoming County is standing one up, I think that the state realized that this is a need and that they've come through with providing the test kits. The testing will also allow students, teachers and staff of school districts in those counties to have access to testing as per yellow zone requirements to possibly reopen with hybrid or other schedules after the holidays. As for the Batavia businesses, now as well with yellow zone restrictions, some relief. They were very concerned of an orange designation. Um, I think that the yellow, they're not happy and I'm not happy with any color designation and we're trying to work hard to get out of it and we'll do everything we can to get out of it. But certainly an orange would have been uh, a significant blow to our local businesses. A yellow is has got some restrictions to it. Uh, it's a warning and, and I'm going to keep on preaching to everyone to please comply with the masks and, and follow the, the, the guidelines so that we can help our local businesses not go to orange. Ron Plants, Channel 2 News.